the graduation party because he was too afraid to go home. <laughs> I figured this would be a fun series on top of my reaction videos to just pick something that's either funny, heart-wrenching, interesting, and come on here and talk about it with you guys. Hey, what's going on? My name is Shane. Welcome back to my channel. If you are new, welcome. I've run into my fair share of people who might not be thinking rationally, and I think in this first video, this lady might end up regretting this decision. Listen, I don't think anything would end up prompting me to actually do this considering I would be the one to be paying for it and someone is right above them recording everything so it's definitely you're not getting away with anything. Just based off of the hashtags used in the video it does say things like hashtag key neighbor's car, hashtag lover's squirrel, hashtag your next, hashtag don't f with an Asian woman, hashtag crazy b, hashtag got no money no honey. <gasps> Oh, some of the comments, you should have said cheese. <laughs> was she aware that someone was right there recording her? Because she didn't once look up, but we also don't know what happened before and after uh, the cameraman started recording. So I don't know. I don't really think she cares in my opinion. Damn, what did you do to her? At no point did I know where this story time was going. Not make this up. Imagine first date with a man. You hit it off. Great energy date runs long and you have a graduation party to get to so i'm like you know what okay you want to come with me to my, to my homegirl's graduation party he's like okay yeah sure but i don't want to show up empty-handed so we we stop at the target another green flag because we've been hitting it off okay great we stop at target he gets her a card we go to the graduation party i introduce her to my i introduce him to my friend cool we go to my car we're getting into my car He's saying like, oh yeah, can you drop me off at the mall, da 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 da, like whatever. Fine, because he allegedly Ubered an hour to get to me because he lives far out, not in the city. This man gets in my car. All of a sudden, a girl, a woman comes up out of the blue. I don't know where this woman was. She comes up and she yanks open my passenger side door. She's like, what the F are you doing? Get up. Come with me right now. Come with me right now. Get up. Get up. You're coming with me. At first, I thought she was joking. And at first, I thought it was like she saw him from afar, thought he was fine. Came into the car, was like, you're coming with me. You're coming with me. Because he was just like, chill, chill, chill. So I was like, oh, okay, that's cute. Like, he's fine. Okay, period, sis. But, like, not too much. But then she gets rowdy. She's like, get out the car. Get out the car. And yanks this full-grown size man and yanks him out the car. So I'm like, oh, y'all know each other takes him out the car bella my car is here her car is here i'm t-boned in i cannot move there's a car in front of me so all i can do is sit and look in my rear view at her beating just beating his ass just beating his ass and i'm like i turn my music down so i can hear what's being said i can't hear nothing but just just going and I'm like, what the heck? I didn't have the word, like, I didn't have the words that happened so fast, and I cannot move. So I'm sitting here, waiting, waiting for her to finish his beating. Finally, they start to back up. They pull up beside me. I'm looking like this. And he goes, <laughs> No, he didn't. No, he didn't. And they drive off. And I just didn't know whether to laugh or cry. Because clearly that's your girl. We talked about cheating. We talked about red flags. We talked about green flags. He had passed a lot of, like he had a good head on his shoulders, I thought. We talked about cheating in 30 minutes. We talked about emotional versus physical cheating. 
and she picked him up and yanked him out of the passenger side. I would have killed to see this, to be a fly on the wall. And they drove off and then he texted me, what are you doing? What am I doing? I'm coping. <laughs> Parallel parks behind them, so they're not going anywhere. She said there's a car in the front. Now the girl's in the back. She comes over, rips him out of the car. That one came from Kiana Nicole on Nick TikTok only a couple days ago. That one was so funny. <laughs> Some of the comments. Please text him back for the plot. We need more. We need more. You can't leave us with that. The way that this man, after this man's beaten, the way that he has the audacity to look at this girl back and go, <laughs> Oh, I'm coping. Took me out. At least she didn't have any smoke from you. She knew who the problem was. You know what? She probably knew damn well what he was doing. This couldn't have been his first time. No way. No way. The way that that woman just manhandled him. There's no way that this is his first time. He was went to the graduation party because he was too afraid to go home. <laughs> uh, 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 uh. Woo! All right, that's going to be it for today's video. If you enjoyed, please show me by leaving a thumbs up. Also, if you want to give me a chance, you can subscribe. You can always unsubscribe, but... I'm going to be collecting these videos, guys. We got to react to some of this stuff. I need someone to share them with. Oh, it's like I'm sending you these TikToks and we're going to laugh about them because, oh my goodness, there is so much stuff. So I hope you guys stick around. Thanks so much if you do, and I'll see you in my next one. Bye.